Hi students. Today I am going to discuss about uh, few objectives on the topic of evaluation. Who are preparing for NEET? These are essential. In the evaluation topic, we are going to learn about how origin of Earth was happened and later how life was arise on Earth planet. These topics are very important. For that, to prove that different scientists they are conducting different experiments to prove that how origin of Earth was happened and moreover the after that how life was arise on the Earth. For that there is no uh, particular evidence but some chemical evidences there chemical evolution is there and they have proved by conducting different experiments. On that. See here first object is which of the following was not found in free form during the origin of life. During the origin of life which was not found in the free form. So here you know that according to Big Bang theory that uh, massive explosion takes place in that only different parts they formed as the different planets. So here being time goes they gradually cool down temperature decrease and they condense state at that time here ammonia and methane oxygen hydrogen these are the four options where here which of the following was not found not found in free form free form you know that that miller experiment also miller used in the condenser here ammonia and methane and hydrogen. So here oxygen not available, it was not available in the free form. After five, what you call UV rays split the H2O into hydrogen and oxygen. Then only oxygen is available in the free form. That's the reason this should be the answer. Not found in free form during the origin of life. Ammonia should be there, it was there, methane was there and hydrogen was there. But this should not be in the free form. After splitting of hydrogen molecule, water molecule, then oxygen was formed. So that's the third one is the option right. We'll go for the next one. Stanley Miller synthesized in his experiment. You know that Stanley Miller experiment, he was created. How the conditions were there in the origin of life, the same conditions he was created in the simulated laboratory condition in that he used electrodes to produce the 800 degree centigrade. At that time he was used ammonia and methane and hydrogen at 80 degree centigrade after he what he got in the prebiotic soup, prebiotic soup or the hot dilute soup, hot dilute soup. In that, what he found? Virus and protein and amino acid and cell. Here virus, there is no chance because of cell was not formed at that time. Proteins are the complex structures and there is also no chance. First that the pre-existing life here, conservatives are there and uh, microbionts are there, protobionts will be formed. So this is the protein is not answer. Amino acids, cell is there is no chance. That's the reason amino acid is the correct answer. Amino, amino acid is the correct answer. So in the pre soup, soup, he found the amino acid. Next one, swan neck flask experiment proved that swan neck plus we parcher was conduct this experiment swan neck plus he has taken the two flasks in that one should be open and released other should be closed then how life was originated for that this flask experiment proved that what it's proved biogenesis or abiogenesis and special creation and fourth one is the action is the one and two Swan neck plus experiment. It is proved the which one biogenesis or it's a biogenesis or it's species special creation. Fourth one is a one and two. For this swan neck experiment, life arises from the 
pre existing life okay not by the god not by the remaining super natural powers so here special creation is the wrong answer a biogenesis a biogenesis of life exist or arises from the a biogenesis from the a biogenesis form a biotic form here biogenesis biogenesis in the air what is there the microbes are there you know they will interact with the yeast and produce the new forms so that's the reason is i proves the biogenesis theory it proves the biogenesis theory and it disproves the a biogenesis theory if they ask disproves the biogenesis theory and proves the biogenesis theory right thank you